What is up guys, in today's video we're going to be going over what enums are and how we can use them in Swift. So to get started we're going to go ahead and, and create an enum by typing the keyword enum and we're going to provide a name and I'm just going to write condition which can be the condition of a car or weather condition or whatever you want. But the enum is going to be a set state. So there's going to be only these states of the condition and we can later use these as constants, in other words. So if we go ahead and create a case of perfect, good, average, and bad, we can describe or tell the program that these are the states of condition and these are the only ones to look out for. Next, we're going to go ahead and create a variable called current condition. And we're going to assign one of these enums to this variable, such as condition.perfect. Now, if we go ahead and print this current condition, we're going to get return to the console perfect. So we can easily use it as a set state. And this also works in case you want to provide that there should be an on and off switch. You can say that these are the only two conditions. There's going to be on and off, and that's it. But uh, let's go ahead and use this in another example, such as using it in a switch statement. So to do this, we will create a switch and inside the switch, we are going to insert the current condition. Then we will open up a pair of curly brackets and we will provide the case of good, which will be the first condition. And here we can write it in good condition. Otherwise we will add the case perfect and we can print amazing how perfect it is. Otherwise we can do dot average and print uh, the condition is average. And finally, we're going to provide the final one, which is bad. And we're going to print, get that bad stuff out of my face. Now, when we go ahead and run this program, we're going to be able to use these enums to make sure that we pick the right options for the right statement or the right case. So as you can see, we only have these four options and we can change this to anything. It can be changed to bad, it's going to give us that as a return. We can change this to average, and then we'll get this statement as a return as well. So essentially we can see enums as a list of constants that we want to make sure the program has so that we can use them later without many errors. But that's actually the last video of this Swift series that I'm going to create because I believe we covered most of the basics that are required for actually creating iOS apps. And don't get me wrong, there's still a lot of stuff to learn regarding Swift, but we will learn that as we start creating real life applications in iOS using Xcode, other frameworks, and so on. But as always guys, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.